Okay, I'm just gonna go get in my uh, ship. I'm gonna get in my ship and leave. And not care if it finishes. weird. Although admittedly it's a glitch I haven't seen in a while. Okay. I'm just going to go upwards. That's not telling me whether or not anyone's been to the system before. Someone has. Ah, a station. Maybe they have some hyperdrive upgrades for me. Right, apparently I am close enough. Didn't realize. I mean, I guess it kind of looked like I was, but you can never tell for sure. I'm going to want to see if I can find some hyperdrive upgrades. Aw. He doesn't have any. At least none that are decent. Sad that the planets are undiscovered, but not a surprise. All right. I guess I should ask, do I have uh, fuel? Holy cow. Our hyperdrive barely used any fuel. Oh, yeah. The hand off the stick. Galaxy map. I'm going to go all the way up here. I don't know if going up is a good idea. And I don't know where the galaxy core is. No idea. It's probably behind me, though. Would the system have a name if it had been discovered? And no name if it was undiscovered? Well, they do have a station here. Looks like I'm pretty close to it. That's good. We're basically warping in right next to them. Would still be nice to be able to upgrade the crud up this hyperdrive. The more fuel efficiency, the better, basically. That way we can guarantee that we can go as far as possible on as little as possible. Wait. 
What are you selling me? What? I'm confused. Aren't you supposed to be selling me ship upgrades? Yeah, upgrade modules. There we go. Aw. Ah, no hyperdrive upgrades. Oh well. Funny how the game has started doing that again. Indium, huh? Let's see now. Now I kind of have to wonder, would a system have a name if it had been, if it had not been charted? All right, I'm going to go for these stars up here, see what I find. I don't know if just going straight up is a good idea. I have no idea how infinite this galaxy is. First contact. Nice. All right, well, let's hit the station. This was a little further away, but that's okay. Oh, it's close enough we can't pulse to it. those up. Well, the translator's getting good at GAC, at least. Oh, is that it? That's disappointing, son. Very disappointing. Alright, I have a feeling we're close. We've started finding systems that are uncharted. So we'll continue to stick to blue systems. Speaking of blue systems, there's one right there. Does anything here tell me my hyperdrive fuel status? I have no idea. Cut throttle. Oh, nice first contact. I still have a lot of systems to go to. Seven more to be precise. This time it was a little further away. Maybe I should have tried pulsing to it. That cold nugget. 
All right. Let's get rid of the gold nugget. Oops. And the silver. I could sell those for a ton of money, but whatever. I'm still intent upon getting those hyperdrive upgrades to try to make this quest easier, even though I'm not having much luck at it. Hello, sir. I need hyperdrive upgrades. You don't have any. Well, you've got this one. Does it give 100% off of... Uh, Off of, um, where did it go? What do I magnetized? Oh, never mind. Where's my upgrade? Seriously, where's my upgrade? Oh, there it is. Oh, that overloaded it. All right, I'll have to dismantle. I could still use one S class to increase the range, but it's actually not necessary to have it. Because our fuel efficiency seems to be maxed out. Because our, oh wow, yeah, look at that. We only use 20% of our fuel. That officially makes this the most efficient <laughs> ship at hyperdrive. Why can't I do this with my freighter? That thing burns fuel. Well, that's not good. Closer. Where'd you go? Is this the one I was shooting at? Lost track of him? I don't have a health bar anymore, so I'm not sure. Yeah, he was the one. He's. I think he's dying. I'm not really sure. Oh, this is the one. Okay. Got him. All right. Oh no, they're helping me. Okay. Don't shoot at the guys who are helping you. bounty on them. Oh well. Can't always get lucky. I might be able to get this all done in one tank of fuel. Ah. That's unfortunate. Let's go here. See if we can find more undiscovered systems. Cut throttle. Ah. There, I thought I was on a roll. Okay. Well, let's continue on upward. 
to the system. Throttle. Yes, first contact. Awesome. Okay. What on earth is this? I think it'll tell me which ones I discovered. I wonder if I don't dock at the station, if I don't unlock them as a teleport destination. Nice. Very nice. Phase four. Got five out of ten. Alright, so this is the way to do this. In your ship, and not your freighter. I just assumed the freighter was the way to do it. I didn't realize they made the ship's hyperdrive so efficient. I remember my ship running out of uh, fuel every four jumps, I think. And they were short jumps, so... Nice, first contact again. sticking to blue stars because only people who know to upgrade their hyperdrive to the max could go to them. So I figure my chances of getting a first contact on them is much higher. So I only have three left. Only three. And there's like five more blue stars in this cluster. Which is making this go very fast all of a sudden after two hours and nine minutes what do we have here oh that's just a start ah oh, discovered by someone else all right am i low on uh not out of fuel yet seems to turn me around to face a different direction each time, which gets confusing very fast. Yes, first contact. Making us travel an absurd distance to get this done. It's funny that it says 10 U's per second. Unless they mean 10 light years per second. Nice. Only need to go one more. Just one more. All right. There's a blue one over there. I'm going to take a risk on it. 